By the way, for other uh, enthusiasts of winter weather, and namely skiers and snowmobilers, uh, the weather pattern going into December looks decidedly colder. So snow chances are going to ramp up around here in the weeks ahead. I know that's like, well, it's December. You will go figure. Well, we've had such a mild stretch. We are going to turn colder um, as we head into Thanksgiving and beyond. OK, for today, light rain in Buffalo. Tomorrow, also some rain showers possible, especially in the morning. Sunday, a better day, still kind of cloudy, but drier with temperatures in the 40s. So we're going to continue with rain close to the lake. Higher elevation snows will continue. A lot of snow falling across uh, New York. You know, this this system is a snow system. The one area where it's not snowing is, is basically Buffalo. There's a reason for it. Uh, some warm air kind of wrapped in as we expected and closer to the lower elevations in the lakes. It is primarily rain, but snow elsewhere. So there's more moisture to come. So we are going to stay with clouds and light rain, a north wind kind of uh, th throughout the day today uh, across uh, higher elevations, though, it will continue with snow. It is let up a little bit in Bradford and Ellicottville, but it's going to fill back in as temperatures, though, slowly warm. This snow will begin to mix over with some raindrops this afternoon uh, as it begins to wind down, but it's going to snow for a while longer. Uh, notice as we go through time, rain showers continuing 40s to the north, 30s to the south. That's why it's rain versus snow tonight. Showers continue. It's going to kind of stay damp, uh, letting up overnight tonight. Then tomorrow, a little bit of light rain moves through during the day. It's not a big deal, but it will be rain. No snow tomorrow. It's rain for everybody. Light rain. And then as we head into Sunday, it starts off with perhaps a rain shower, a sprinkle, but most of the day will be dry. OK, so a better day on Sunday. Uh, additional snow today, you know, another inch or two, especially for the hilltops as this system begins to wind down. So for today, light rain, snow in the hills, a north wind 10 to 20 miles an hour. As we go into tonight, we're going to see lows in the 30s, light rain showers continuing. Spend a little time on the seven day here and kind of walk you through it as we head towards the week of Thanksgiving. Sunday, mostly cloudy skies. On Monday, we're going to see another system approach. It starts off as rain, but then on Tuesday, rain showers in Buffalo, but there's a chance for some lake effect snows for the southern tier on Tuesday. Accumulating snows are possible on Tuesday. Wednesday, we're down into the 30s. We're getting colder. Next week, Thursday, Friday, there are signs that there could be, could be a weather system that could bring us a mix of rain or snow, maybe just snow. Light at this point for Thanksgiving. This is something to watch because some simulations have a bigger system here. So we're going to keep an eye on it. What's for sure is behind it, colder air comes in, it looks like, for the turkey trot on Friday and then into the following weekend. And as we start a new month of December, it will be getting colder. So more wintry on what has been a crazy warm fall, a crazy warm October, November 2, we are going to trend cooler uh, by Thanksgiving and into the following weekend. All right, and while this first round of winter weather arrives in western New York, be sure to download the Two on Your Side app. That way you can get live radar, weather impact alerts, and the seven-day forecast all in the palm of your hand. It's free to download right now from your smartphone's app store. So be aware, Black Friday may be a white Friday in a lot of western New York, right? It could be. It could, it could be. Could I know be. a lot of turkey trotters are like, what? Yeah, all right. It's going to be chilly, it looks like. Thanks for joining us for Daybreaker News. Continues at WGRZ.com.